the first preliminary activity that needs to be performed before the tradition or the festival comes off is called Abelija, sharing of corn. Now, the corn isn't shared among clan houses. It is shared among deities, the main deities that head the corn township. Uh -huh. Now, this corn is supposed to be given to the priest or priestesses who are the ones representing the deities. They will be using parts of the corn for a traditional wine called Mada, which has been corrupted to Mada. And then they will use the rest of it to do corn flour, like roasted corn flour. And these two items will be used in worshipping these gods two weeks from now. Now, every shrine or every deity will be poured libation with this wine called Mada. And during the worship, a, a, a goat or a sheep will be killed. And when that happens, they will prepare the goat, use the stock to mix with the corn flour, the roasted corn flour, yes. And the stock will be mixed and they will add palm oil to it. It is called mushe. It is called mushe. This will be sprinkled to the goat. And then the other priests or priestesses there or anybody involved in the activity or the shrines of the uh, tradition performed by the corn, traditional area, has the right to eat that food. Yes has the right to eat that food. And when this is done, that is when that Kuleju activity comes off. As you all remember last year, we came to you with the Kuleju activity, which is the act of showing disrespect to people who think they are doing something that nobody has noticed. Yeah, it is a tradition where you are being called upon to, to set aside from your bad ways, yeah, for you to realize what you are doing, to you, for you to realize how wrong you are. That is what basically the whole thing is about. But this is the first activity we are doing. So we will come back to you with the rest act of the activities when the time is due for them to happen. But for now, this is the first preliminary activity, which is the Akpong Abeleja, the sharing of corn to the deities, the six deities of Kung, which is Aya, Klan, Usabu, Gao, Dingla, and Nyankomle. These are the people or the deities the corn will be shared to. A, a group of people will be carrying the corn from the chief's palace straight to the Aya shrine. Aya is the first and the eldest of all the deities in Kuhn. And so her Wulomo, or her, her chief Wulomo, is the chief of Kuhn, that is where the rites will be performed at. But right now we are in the palace of the Kuhn chief, which uh, the rites, the first Kusun is being performed, that is sharing of the corn into the basins. And then it will be carried from here to Ayana, the chief deity. That is where the sharing will be there. I am so happy today because I can see my mom is around. The Aya Woyu, the priestess of the Aya gods, Aya deity. Yes, the priestess of Aya deity. She is here. And this year shows a lot of unity. Seeing her around makes me so happy because she, she works along with the chief. Mm -hmm. She is the priestess and the chief is the Wulomo. There's no way any tradition can happen at Aya now that she shouldn't be involved. In case the deity wants to send a message, she, the, the deity possesses her, the Ayawayu, and she brings out the information given from the deity. And so I'm happy she is around today, and you will see her, and you will see how the tradition and everything will go about. Keep following and watching and sharing. Thank you all.
Yabi, at long last, we are at the end. I am not taking position. I am not taking position.